Has a concert ever needed a sequel? Really? Someone tell me. Because yes, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles coming out of their shells tour had a sequel. There's a net to every word we say. Pizza USA. I So yeah, you can do a sequel to anything, really, as long as there's some kind of story to tell. And believe me, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles getting down in your town... ...exists? Oh, I'm kidding, of course, this doesn't exist. I mean, there were a lot more stories to tell after the turtles banished Shredder to the black hole for hating music. Yeah, I'm a big liar, Pants. I showed Shredder sent to hell last time, but don't worry, kids. He was just sent to purgatory. So while the coming out of their shells tour was extremely silly, there was still a sense of effort and energy to it. But apparently by getting down in your town, the turtles meant bringing your town down to their extreme depression. And I really am sorry to say that's not much of a stretch. There are several times they cut to the crowd and they look like the turtles are talking to them about the joys of skipping stones. Well, either that or they're telling them how Splinter's heart was skipping beats. And he had a heart attack. And died. That's our fun way of telling you Splinter couldn't be here today, little dudes. Cause he's dead! Uh, why are they doing this to us? Mom, can we leave? No refunds! Cowabunga! While this show unfortunately doesn't feature the turtles' quick skin change ability, we do have another version of their costumes. This time kinda looking like a combination of both from last time, meaning no shells and no mouths closing. <laughs> Well, they seem to have the same difficulty with them like they did the backstage outfits from last time, but on the plus side, they don't look like they came from 101 Turtle Mations this time. Yep, no spots, just holes in the back of the head. I've always heard brain ventilation was a good idea. Perhaps I should try it. Who told you that? The turtles from this concert. So, the ones with brain ventilation. Right. Now, I know a lot of you just found the music and coming out of their shells to be cheesy garbage, but me, I actually found a lot of them pretty catchy. Shut up! Don't look at me! But like with everything in this second concert, the music just seems lazier, and even I can't enjoy this. Waiting for the cue to take the stage. The lights are out, the dues are paid. Turn another page Get down in your town You get out of my town right now, turtles. But look at these kids. They sure are glad that the turtles are getting down in their six flags. Dude, we can't even get a real concert anymore. We're relegated to playing amusement parks. Settle down, Michelangelo. It's not about the fame. It's about the music. The music sucks! Ah! Well, fuck! Hey, at least we got some turtles toys out of this. They're not even trying anymore, are they? I'm totally singing this song right now. Whoa! Who cares if my mouth even remotely matches? Whoa! We're so damn lazy! Whoa. Good work with the overlaid fireworks, Donnie. It really adds the missing excitement. Alright, for those of you who think I'm too boring and have an annoying Muppet voice, which is a contradiction in terms in my book, well, here you go! Yay! I'm exciting now! Woo! Yay.
Oh, wow. Why aren't we watching fireworks right now instead? Aw, oh, damn it! You ruined our concert with your stupid plan, Donatello! Wow, fuck! You know what I have to say? Thank you! We love you! See you all again. Well, it's not great to hear you not, Cam Clark. It was a shock he was involved with the first one, but it's a real shock that he's not involved with the second one, huh? Leonardo's voice this time is also not very distinctive, and it really gets hard to tell him and Raph apart. Oh, excuse me. All right, fine. That's it, you two. <laughs> no more whoa, stupid whoa, whoa, jokes. Leo. Guess it doesn't really matter, as it seems like Leonardo is written as Raphael 2 for this concert anyway. You no, know, Mike, you look so stupid doing that. I thought you were supposed to be the level-headed one. Leo. Shut the fuck up, I'll murder you all! I don't like this concert. Did I say you could talk? <laughs> hey, dudes and dudettes, did you miss us? <laughs> Good one. Without all of you, we wouldn't have an audience. <laughs> oh, my Mike, man. you promised. No bad jokes. That was a joke? Well, maybe it's not that Leo is written as Raph this time. It's just that he fucking hates Mikey's guts now. I'll never forgive you for fucking me over in Jeopardy, Michelangelo! The answer was Calabunga, dude! I pretty much gave you that! I don't want to hear it! Dudes, we're gonna sort out our issues! We'll be right back! What? Music is more powerful than violence. It's better to pick up an instrument than a pair of nunchucks. Shut up, turtles. They're right, you know. I love the Tuckney Drum so bad. It houses everything I love, like crying. I think it's the worst! You're the worst, Shredder. And we're not gonna mention it was Splinter who taught us that pacifism crap because he died between tours! Thank you! He's dead! Thank you! And thank you for fucking that one up, Michelangelo! Uh-oh, Splinter's daddy -os. We have a very special friend traveling with us. Whoa! Yeah. Hey, a major Gak face. Gak face? That's one of the things he called him in the movie. Yeah. Give it up for that totally pneumatic Casey Jones! Da -da 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 Hey guys, about time you hotheads got wise and brought me Yo, a And it's about time you shave that armpit hair, Casey. That's a bit much. My armpit hair gives me my power! What the fuck are we watching? Casey means is that now he's our head toady. Holy shit, someone put a bullet between Leo's eyes. Who killed Leonardo? Who cares? If we need something, we just tell him to do it and Casey has to do it for us. Hey, Casey. How about getting us a soft drink? Eh, shut up. Whoa. Casey, how about, uh, sharpening my sword? What, is your arm's broken or something? Be right to! How about ordering a pizza? Yeah, who died and made you, boss? Oh, man, that Casey is a badass motherfucker. He don't do what you tell him to. Hey, Casey, why don't you come join my video? Eh, uh, I ain't joining your stupid review. Oh shit! Doodly doobity doop doop doop. Well, I took a little trip to interdimensional infinity, and with the help of our resident genius Donatello here, I brought you dudes back a little something. You fixed Shredder's eyebrows? Oh, Casey, you shouldn't have. <laughs> yeah, I know I shouldn't have. That's why I did it. I'm glad you did it. I didn't do it then. I'm a rebel. Hey, <laughs> sure. So, really, Casey Jones decided that risking getting lost in dimensional limbo was worth it to put a camera in Shredder's face just to show that his mask has somehow gotten even worse? Oh, look, no way! Check it out, it's Edward Scissor's face! Uh... Isn't it dangerous opening a window between, like, 
there and here? He's in predisposed suspended animation! Ah, yes, it's that new suspended animation where your animation isn't suspended. Love that one. Booga 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 booga. Oh, real mature. Hey, he doesn't even know we're watching. That's an invasion of privacy, Turtles. And sure, he murdered three people last time, but two wrongs do not make a right. Or maybe they do. I don't know. Who cares? And here I thought Krang and I were bored on the Teptodrome watching Channel 6 all the time. At least we never set up cameras in those blasted turtles' bathroom. Wait, I'm brilliant. Krang, set up some cameras in the turtles' bathroom. <laughs> what was that, Foggy? I swore I just heard you say put cameras in the uh, turtles' Never mind, Krang. <laughs> Ain't nothing can compare to the basic frisbee fair of the kind of slices we get every day. Pizza USA. Whoa! Are you listening to every word we say? Pizza USA. I miss skipping stones. You hear that getting down in your town tour? You just got me to honestly miss what I used to think was the dumbest song in the universe. How did you do that? Hey guys, remember when we were in that office waiting room eating pizza? Wow, what an awesome cutaway. You listen to every word we say, Pizza USA. Uh... <coughs> Splinter's dead, USA. Michelangelo, you're gonna be dead, USA! Oh shit, USA! Damn, pizza power, this is not. That song got played on Turtles in Time. The only place Pizza USA got played was in bathrooms. Chase it all and you away. Pizza USA! Pizza USA! Why did you want to set this up? I told you to never mind, Craig! Whoa, there's the budget. Empty pizza boxes. And holy shit, Casey broke out the scooter. <laughs> it was a no scooter zone. Actually, they were fine with it. Kids were allowed to ride their bikes and everything. I hate you! You're not my real father! Oh shit, I'm sorry. There was still room in the budget for rubber pizzas. Truly, this was needed for this destruction of all that is good in the world. I finally get the song, I Hate Music. No, I don't. Hey look, we got footage of people clapping earlier in the day because they sure as fuck weren't clapping for that, USA. Sometimes I've reacted too violently. Violently? You tried to steal all the music in the world! Yes, that's behind me now. Hey, remember how we said Shredder couldn't hear us earlier? Well, uh... Hey, look at how shitty his screening is! Even the stars are going right through him. Because he's in space, apparently. <laughs> Good thing he's in suspended animation, or that might kill him. Hey, Don! Is there a way we can talk to old Chrome Dome? Chrome Dome was someone else, you stupid fuck! And by some way to talk to him, do you mean like this? You tried to steal all the music in the world! Yes, that's behind me now. Guess he didn't really hear that, cause Shredder just thought maybe the turtles were saying that despite supposedly not seeing or hearing them. I just have to reverse the polarity of the Megatronic force field and reintroduce the gravitational latitudinality. We'll do it, dude. I'm Leo Angelo now. I have no personality of my own. Can you hear me? Children, I must talk to you. Beware of the turtles. They are up to no good. They are evil and deceitful. <laughs> it's a good thing we turn this on. I have proof. Proof of what? Yeah. Proof that exposes you for the evil dudes you really are. So, this was the Shredder's plan this whole time? Sit around in time code land and then hope the turtles would be dumb enough to put a camera in his face in order to discredit them? Where did he come up with this stuff? Show him what he's in there for! Yeah! yeah. Music is a more powerful weapon than violence! I know the turtles aren't always the brightest, but they don't come off that dumb, do they? Oh, oh yeah! Oh, okay. And luckily, through some clever editing, we can get the crowd too! 
like a board earlier that day. Sing about it. Got to sing about it. No. Oh, oh, yeah. Wait, did they just pipe in fake cheers? Just lie about it. The crowd really enjoyed that. Just lie about it. Shredder, how's that for the magic of music? The song did nothing to me. Music damages you now? That wasn't even a thing in the first concert. It was just those mutant morons who got damaged from lack of music. So I guess it's not that much of a stretch, is it, Shredder? Ouch. What the hell am I doing? Now admit it. Admit to these children what evil dudes you really Just are. Just a second, you cheap old Darth Vader ripoff. Yeah, they both wear masks. Shredder, what a Darth Vader ripoff. I am your father. Damn it, Shredder. This is the proof of your wickedness. Wow, you can make VHS tapes float? Yup. Ah! Aha! Aha! Clean that up! No! Cleaning is for losers! Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do it! Casey, would you just get the hell out of here? No! You don't tell me what to do! Oh, Shredder, that's a videotape! Is that episode one or is that number two? Secret <laughs> of the use! Self-referential jokes are lame. Ah! Wait, did Shredder just fall into Star Fox? What the hell is going on with this? Yeah, let's just keep flipping through backgrounds and put them anywhere. Ah! Well, that's not so bad. Ah! Ah, uh, no comment. This is the truth, and the truth will set me free! Of course, because if the kids watch Shredder's home documentary on the turtles being poop heads, they'll... Um... It'll free him by... Um... You got anything? Ah! I shall destroy these videotapes! Ah! 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 Sounds like a shredder plan, whatever. Play your tape! I'd love to, but there's one small problem. There are no video players here. No excuses, problem, excuses, Razorhead! Man. You could play it right here! I'll have you out in a second! Was the goal of the Getting Down in Your Town concert to prove they could in fact be dumber than singing about hating music? Yeah, way to go, you blasted turtles! Even I wouldn't fall for something that stupid! All that matters is I'm rid of you! You haven't gotten rid of us at all! And you sure haven't beaten us, Creepazoid! All you did was stuff us through a portal because you're too chicken to fight us! Ah! Alright, turtles! Come out and fight! Ah! Ah! So the teenage moronic Nimrod turtles release Shredder, which of course surprises them! Come to see the four green geeks, we have you? Get away, Shredder! We know who you are and we know where you live! Hey, Shredder, I know who you are! What? Oh! Okay, that's somehow actually a thread, apparently. Oh, whatever. Let's just get to what's actually on Shredder's tape. If they don't have VCRs in Interdimensional Infinity, how could he make the videotape? So, there isn't even a Tape? Where'd the tape come from then? Oh, right, Fox. <laughs> Last year, you gotta do it this time. It's your turn. Yeah, okay, fine. Done. The turtles just passed the buck over to Casey. Um... You bunch of weenies? What? Yeah, I know we were complete morons and let them out for no good reason, but you deal with it, Casey. Teenage Mutant Ninja Asshole. So luckily, no soft kicks for old Shredhead this time, just <laughs> this. Come on, Jones, I'm waiting for you. This is a 
actually happening. This was put to tape. This was shown in front of people. Hey, Shredder, you tired to get your butt kicked yet? Oh, you'll pay for that, Jones. <laughs> I don't know what I love about this the most. The mistimed sound cues, the blows from about five feet away, or just the complete dead silence. Watch it, Jones. And the crowd goes wild! <coughs> uh, your table's waiting, sir. Dumpster for one. <laughs> what? You won't get away with this. Shredder didn't count on the turtles doing anything. Was he counting on the show's theme of lazy to save him? And speaking of, they throw him in a dumpster, which somehow teleports him back to Purgatory Fox, USA. Hasta la vista, baby. What did I do to deserve this, turtles? What did I do? No, 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 no. I'm done. I'm, I'm fucking done. To the garbage dimension with me. <laughs> ah! Oh no, I'm in the garbage dimension. <gasps> and I really don't care. I mean, it's better than where I was. And even though I can't see or hear getting down in your town anymore, I'll continue commenting like I can. Besides, all that's left is just one more song to remind you that they clearly gave more of a shit in the other concert. Sober and done, time to have us some fun. Why yes, now that this black hole of joy is over, we can have some fun. This second concert is just really sad. There seems to be a lack of passion on every aspect of this versus the Coming Out of Their Shells tour. They were both silly, but you could tell they were trying there. It still had a sense of fun. Getting down in your town as a sense of reminding you that your time could be better spent on drilling holes in the back of your head. Ah, now that that fair nomadic Felis is gone, I think I'll stop doing reviews. Because I hate reviews! I think they're the worst! Whoa, what do you think you're doing, Bebop? I'm taking over! And I'm not Bebop. I know that, I'm just saying it because I don't care, because I'm a badass! Shut it, Jones, or I'll release your sex tape. And I don't mean the one with Miss O'Neill. Come on, juicy codes! How's Carter lately? Oh, that is it! Uh, uh, what's his name? Lord Drag! <laughs> I was better off in here! Shit, I really didn't think this through. Now I'm stuck in a limbo dimension. This is really gonna take a big storyline to get me out of here. Oh, screw it, I'll just go home.